We are running out of grain here. Ah. Ah, there's one that looks mostly intact. Connecting now. Sweet Jesus. Manual override initiated. Cryogenic Again. stasis. I'll try to locate another memory as quickly as I can. Please try to remain calm. That's good. Checking through the logs. Hopefully it's all just find it. Pod C6. Down the hall near the end. The eggheads never liked taking orders from a dirty, contaminated degenerate like me. But they needed me, and I made sure they knew it. I never knew why we didn't just refreeze the rest of them. But we had our orders. <laughs> I guess the old man didn't want so many loose ends. Too bad he left alive the one person he shouldn't have. The eggheads never liked taking. The eggheads never liked taking orders. I was now the Institute's main operator in the Commonwealth. If they needed something done, they came to me. It wasn't usual for anybody from the Institute to come along on a mission, so this one stood out. I didn't know then who it was we were grabbing from the vault. Of course, neither did they. Not really. Even then, I knew it was a mistake leaving her alive. I understood that kind of revenge. No one better. But I was cocky enough to assume I could handle some soft, pre-war vault dweller. Even if she somehow got thawed out. At least I know those Institute bastards will soon get what's coming to them, too. If she could take me out, they won't be able to hide from her for long. I'm glad I didn't have to kill the kid. I'm not saying I haven't done it, but, uh, I never liked to. But it was better this way. Better than taking his kid and leaving him alive. This is the one. Here. Open it. Who's that sexy girl? <clears throat> Is it Almost. Okay? Everything's gonna be fine. Okay? Come here. No. Come here, baby. No. I got him! Let the boy go. I'm only gonna tell you once. I'm not giving you Sean! Almost finished, Kellogg. I just need to confirm. Come on, come on, come on. All right, we're good. I'm, uh, I'm sorry you had to go through that again. I found another intact memory. Whenever you're ready. Basically, the reason why she said that is because you can go to the memory den a lot earlier and see this scene. Not in detail, but you can. Basically, everybody. Oh no, you're reliving it. Never mind. We're done. We already saw that shit. We gotta get something closer. Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So. 
good news, I think. Wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid, like a happy little family. I ended up kind of liking it. A reminder of what my life might have been if things had turned out differently. But there's no going back. I knew it was just temporary. It'd be back to normal business before too long. This whole setup in Diamond City was part of some elaborate plan of the old man's. Seems obvious now that we were bait for our friend from the vault. Timing couldn't have been an accident. It's not how the old man works. I wonder if he outsmarted me in the end. Another loose end tied up. Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days, you're gonna get your head blown off just barging in here like that. The new breed of synths could easily pass as human. Some of them did. But the Coursers, they weren't built to blend in. They were killing machines, pure and simple. Smarter, stronger, and faster than almost any real human. I'm just glad they were always on my side. Minimizing my exposure to civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. I don't know, but this fucking radio. Some heads are gonna roll for this. For something else, man. Just elimination. Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys. Damn. So, I guess you're taking the kid back with you. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home to my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. Poor kid. He just doesn't know. It wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid. Hmm. Six eighty-eight. Ready to relay with Sean. Bye, Mr. Kellogg. I hope I see you again soon. Damn, they teleported. And I can Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the Institute because there is no entrance. Let me pull you out of there, as soon as you're ready. Well, how the fuck we're gonna leave? And Jesus. Because it's damn music. Oh my god. I still, I still got another 45 minutes of this recording, I'm letting you know right now. And here we go, this damn thing. Movements, okay? I don't know because... This radio is on, and holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, the radio, the radio, the radio, the radio, the radio, the radio, the radio. You know what? I know where it's at. It's, it's bullshit because it's playing louder and louder, and I don't like it because the fact that it's bullshit around here. Oh my god. Yep, it's copyrighted. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. Jesus. 
Oh, it's gone. Eh, it was probably probably the uh, blah blah blah. I'm not talking right. It's probably from the memory. Amari, let's start over. How are you feeling? Side effects. Uh, am I okay? Are you seeing anything? Anything bad? Don't be alarmed. But I honestly don't know what to look for. As I said before, this is uncharted territory. But your neural and physiological readings have returned to normal. From a medical standpoint, you're fine. Are you ready to talk about what happened in there? Kellogg's life, teleportation, Virgil. There's more than one person who knows about the Institute. Virgil, that scientist who escaped. I didn't know Institute scientists could defect. This changes everything. He could answer all sorts of questions. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That can't be right. No one would risk going there. Not even to hide. Perfect hiding spot. He's probably dead. That's why he's there. To make the Institute think twice about following him. That must be it. He's using the radiation and the glowing sea like a shield or a cloak. A way to throw them off and be at an advantage. If Virgil found a way to survive there, you'll have to do the same. If you're going to follow him. How do I fight that much radiation, Doctor? There are chemical compounds. Radax, Radaway. You'd need as much as you could carry. Maybe more. A sealed environment suit would be great if you could find one. Or maybe one of those suits of power armor? That would be perfect. I'll find a way to get through the rads. Don't worry. Good luck. And be safe. By the way, I unplugged Mr. Valentine first. Remove the implant while you were waking up. He's waiting for you upstairs. Nice. Well, we found someone else to help out with Curie. Curie's another... Well, you remember. You guys... Man, you guys should know. The glowing sea. Oh, fuck. We're gonna have to find Virgil. Excuse me. Let's talk to Nick. Hey, Valentine. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head. <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. Kellogg... Nick? Kellogg. Is that you? What? What are you talking about? You sounded like Kellogg just then. Did I? Huh. Mari said there might be some mnemonic impressions left over. Anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. Or I could head back to Diamond City, since you've got company already. Nah, I'll take him because he's a robot. He can live through radiation. The other one can't. Technique, you're a risk. Let's get going, Nick. Been one heck of a ride so far. Let's see where it takes us next. <clears throat> well, we'll send Piper back um, to Sanctuary, and we'll deal with their leader. Oh, hold the fucking phone. We got like two quests going on. All right, glowing sea. I don't even know where that's from. Sorry, baby girl. I'll talk to you later. Actually, you know what? I think I can talk to her now. Heading my way? Travel with me. Actually, you know no. What? Never mind. You know where to find me. Damn, girl. You don't have to be attitude. Shit. Let's go. Sweet Jesus, so we have to go into the glowing sea, basically. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> oh, I think, if I'm correct, it, it's the ocean of nothing but radiation. But. Good neighbor. Lowest place in the Commonwealth. Everything not nailed down rolls through here at some point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy though, his subroutines. Mm -mm. I'm just glad we killed that sucker. Oh, 
Alrighty, so we got some power armor here, and well, Okay, so my systems are continuing to function at peak efficiency. I wish I had the whole set for this. I wish. I'm not gonna lie, I wish. It's astounding how much I still have to discover out here. But I have to take this one for the fact that this I don't know. It just I would wonder what you look like as a robot. Oh look at him. He's over here hitting on me. Look at that. Look at that. This motherfucker. Alright anyways. Alrighty. So we're gonna improve this sucker. We're gonna um, change the headlamp to a bright white light. Recon sensors. Internal database. I like that. These little modifications that, you know this actually has is pretty good so we're gonna increase everything and um, blood cleanser addicted for many drugs not bad that's actually good I'm actually happy I'm having these 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 upgrades, man. There's a lot of stuff that I haven't even used. And then the helmet. Alrighty, so now we are going to use said power armor and we're gonna get things going. But first, we need to go buy um, more right away and ooh, damn, that that's just bright. Oof, we're gonna need that. All right, ooh, we can carry more stuff too. Look at that, purify water, fifty caps. Okay. <clears throat> All right, back to the scene. We need to go ahead and buy a lot of shit because that's good. We need to go buy um, more right away. We need to buy um, radix, and we need to just avoid a lot of radiation because the radiation is gonna kill us over there and we really don't need it so um okay yeah they were doing all that bullshit right now so I'm just gonna take their crap I'm not gonna lie I feel more bulky is it me or like? Eh, I didn't. I never know you could see from this standpoint. Oh wow! All right. Well, let's talk to this chick and sell some stuff. I can rest easy knowing that Wolfgang is rotten and. Let's see what you got. A little bit of everything. 
I'm gonna invest money into this because eventually she's gonna have better stuff. But anyways. Sweet Jesus. Alrighty. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Those stim packs are going to be very useful. All right, it's good shit. Come on, Nick, get out of the way. Really, Nick? Really? Look alive. Go ahead. Over here. Good plan. Shop's open. What do you? Get the hell out of my way, that's what I want. Okay. Find Virgil in the Glowing Sea. So basically, the Glowing Sea is over here. So let's go ahead. And we're gonna travel. A bit distance, so. Let's get things going. So let's get going. I don't want to do any side things right now. I'm going to go on main quests all the way. So let's get through it. Fucking for real. I just got here. Son of a bitch. God damn. I just repaired. I just got this thing fully built. And I don't know, man. Let's just go to this damn sea place and get the hell out of town. like the way into the the fucking thing the edge of the glowing sea oh shit No lie, I want to get this repaired because this is going to bother me and I really, really don't need this shit. Oh, and by the way, I am gonna take a fucking good gun. You best believe I'm gonna take like an automatic. Ooh, my baby. 
the fury no actually you know what that thing is actually pretty pretty strong I'm not gonna lie oh, but that one yeah I'll take the fury and I'll leave I'll leave that one behind but I want to repair this I want this to be like a hundred percent because this is bullshit Come on. You got shit to do. I kind of see why, though. Look at that. Look at this whole area right here. going to be a headache. Here we go. The fucking the the fucking glowing sea. Let's um We'll hit that much. Hit a stem pack. This place got hit really bad. We got no time for this, man. Radiation's in the essence. We need to take these motherfuckers out. Let's go. Okay, done. Keep going. 